Hello, welcome back to Dark Souls. Right, I'm leaving Blight Town because Blight Town sucks and it reminds me of Swindon. And Clyke is here with me in the call. Because we just Fuck dissed you, Jolly Blight Corporation. Town. Yeah, pretty much. We just dissed Jolly Corporation, which I should have recorded. And you should have really done that. I should have done. Uh, we'll, we'll, what we're going to try and do is try and do. Um, uh, what's it? Yarn Golem later if we can. That'd be quite cool. Yep. Would be cool. Um, anyway, I have a plan. I'm only re I'm recording this now. It's really early in the day. I'm going to be doing the rest of it as per normal with you guys on Twitter. Um, yeah, screw you, Swindon Mosquito. Right. Um, but yeah, I'm just getting out of Blight Town because there's stuff I need to do, but I'm sure you guys would be a little bit upset if I didn't record me showing you the back way out of Blight Town. People have asked me, how on earth do you do it? So, I don't know. Clicker. How do I Blight Town, Halloween? Well, the way to Blight Town, Mr. Clicker, is to use the lift and the walk out. It's really nice and easy. <laughs> Yeah. The way to Blight Town is a sharp knife into your heart. <laughs> Trust me, a sharp knife into your testicles, more like. Yeah. Like, this is the way I would have come if I wasn't being stupid and going in the front way, because there's no reason to come in the front way, really. This way is much better, because look at this shit, look how much you skip. <laughs> it's it's amazing, actually. It really is. Yeah. I can't believe after seeing you trot through the front entrance, I still decided, since I never took that way, to actually try it out. I can't, so. I can't believe you've never done that way. And how how I've, how unpleasant well, no, was it for you? I think it's it's very good that I've never done that way because I never want to do it again. That is, that is true. I mean, once you go blight town, you never come back, do you? Yeah. It's like once you smash your balls in between a door, you're not going to try that one again. That is true. I mean, I've done it the once, and I've never do it again. I mean, they all they went black and dropped off. It wasn't nice. Uh, I'm gonna go after the firekeeper, so I think I might as well do it now rather than later. Blood stain on the elevator in my game. Oh crap, I forgot, I forgot, I forgot. Toxic man is here. Uh oh. I haven't been toxic, don't worry. I'll just homeward bone if I have to. That's sad. Really. Oh, goddamn Swindon mosquitoes. Look, no one likes you. Go away, I'm trying to. There we go. It's Swindon. Are mosquitoes in Swindon really like that? Yeah, they're like 20 foot tall and they like spit blood at you. <laughs> Isn't that every Brit ever? Oh shit. See? Did you, did you just do the whole every Brit ever thing? Yes. Oh, yeah. I also said zing. Did you? Out loud, yes. You zinged out loud? I zinged out loud. Am I, am I officially allowed to punch you now? Did you know that zing in uh, German actually means singing? Uh, no. Okay, not written the way that you know it, but uh, it doesn't matter. Go back to Dark Souls. Uh, yeah, th th thank you for that bit of trivia. Any, any other bits of German trivia? <laughs> the real German soul starts here. Can you can you cook me some schnitzel tonight, please? <laughs> I actually have some schnitzel. Oh, yeah, so no, I've got some in the fridge, Oh, actually. God, I'm toxic. Yeah, yeah, see, that's what's almost Whoop, happened to me. I'm just having to we. chill out here and wait. Uh, there's some guy out there, he has a major hard on for me. I need to try and take him out. Let's go. There we go. Look at this! Look at this! There's two of these chaps! It's horrible. I'm not even sure where I'm going. <laughs> oh, I've been toxic Blight Town in a nutshell is I'm not even sure where I'm going. Blight Town in a nutshell is I've been toxic. Oh god, I'm on I've been toxic. Oh god, I'm on fire. Oh god, I've died. Alright. Yeah, welcome ladies and gents, this is toxic proper, like, this is me not clearing the toxic. So, I'm gonna clear the toxic after I've got rid of these wankers, because otherwise I'm just going to get toxic again. Ugh, Yo, bro, it take, I like take so much damage, holy crap! What? We heard, we heard you like toxic, so we put some toxic in your toxic, so you can get toxic while you're toxic. Can I actually hit him from here? Probably not. Nope. Alright. Now he fell down anyway, screw you both. Okay, I'm gonna clear my toxic from here actually. I've only got one, so I might as well. There we go. Right. That sucked. Uh, unfortunately, down here are two very angry fire dogs who. Well, three very angry fire dogs. Who don't really. And that knob. They don't really appreciate me dropping down on them, but you know what? Tough shit. Ah, gotcha. Oh! Oh, that's not good. I'm just gonna heal up quick. Yo, frame rate. I heard you liked missing me. Yeah, can you come back, please? Appreciate that. Ooh, okay, that's one down. Again, can't use my pyromancy on these guys, which would be helpful. Ah, yes, yes, they're both dead. There is there is a reason I'm actually here and torturing myself rather than just leaving. It's because there's something very important here. Ah, uh, crap! I've lost him. Where the hell is he? Oh, there he is. Oh, there's two more dogs here. I actually forgot that. I oh, keep Jesus. picking up this fucking purple moss, and it keeps standing on in my fucking screen, and I can't do shit. So dumb. Wait, oh, I see what you mean when you kill them. Yeah, yeah. like you kill them, and it goes, You just picked up some moss! And it's like, I know! Get away! Oh, 
There we go. Anyway, I'm killing all these toxic dudes to get the fire keepers. Yeah, that's what I'm doing as well, currently. By that I mean dying to the dogs, actually. These, I swear to god, these dogs are like some of the worst enemies in the game. I have no idea how to get to, to that guy on the other side. How the fuck do I kill him? Uh, usually you shoot either from range or he drops down eventually when you get too close to him. Try and force him down is usually the yeah, best way. Yeah, I'll force him down, it's cool. Either that just throw a fireball at him. No, I'm gonna it. use my crossbow plus five. There we go. Shoot them. I like right. this crossbow plus four. Oh god, there's more dogs! I thought I'd actually cleared all you suckers. God, that is horrible. Horrible, horrible, horrible. Yeah, hey Mr. Dog, how's it going? Oh. That's one dog. Where's the second one? There you are. You know, what's it like being a dog? And like, the, making my life why miserable? Do you enjoy again? it? You're toxic again? I, I used my anti-toxic and I was toxic again, immediately. That's some weird shit. That's why I didn't use it, because I was happy I cleared most of them, to be honest. Do you want to know the best way of dealing with these stupid sods? Setting them on fire. Oh, yeah, I bet. Aha. I'm just hitting them with my club with nails in it. I still can't believe I'm using that. Oh, I'm just going to go back the way I came. Right, Firekeeper's soul in hand, and we can leave now. By the way, do dude, there's like 20 dogs down there. I swear they've added more dogs. Yeah, no, I, I hate those dogs. I'm going to kill them right now. Hopefully okay, not yeah, get killed. Second. Oh, probably should have used some flesh sweat before and just to be sure, but eh. Kill them with one hit. So it's mm, good. I don't think that makes much difference. Oh, it's fire, but still. Yeah, but most of the damage comes from them biting you, really, over the fire. Yeah. Uh, also one hit kills. Don't forget, don't forget to get the item either. Eh. Oh yeah, I got it. Yeah, good times. Okay, gonna leave. I'm gonna leave Blight Town now because it's absolutely terrible and full of Germans. <gasps> German town. Is this basically your hometown? This is. Well, yeah. Yeah, yeah. I thought as much. Oh, I've gone way, the wrong way. My hometown is called Molsum, which is, if you think about it a little bit, it's kind of like an abbreviation from German called Mülsum. Which basically would mean, if you translated it directly, trash swamp. So what you could train trash swamp is into trash, a, a sort of a blight on the landscape. I could say that I live in Blight Town. Yes, it's beautiful. It doesn't surprise he, me. Anyway, I got myself the firekeeper salt. He heard it. From, he heard it from him. He lives in Swindon. <laughs> That's why you were on jury duty. Yeah, I'm doing my yeah jury duty in Swindon. It's gonna be good. All right. It's all about the Germans. Oh yeah, there's a giant testicle in the wall again. I should have killed that. Instead I got killed by it and then left it alone. Has the pyromancy behind it if I remember right. Uh need to get my key, which I don't actually need, but whatever. Da -da 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 -da. And there we go. Out of light. Oh. Yeah. However, we got three fatties to get past. I what I should do is just run past the fatties, but I'm not going to. Oh, there's the eagle shield I picked up, which is useful. I'm not trying to find Ah oh, there we go. Gonna put on my good stuff again because I don't, don't need my uh, anti-fire and anti-poison stuff anymore. One very important tip, by the way. I'm not sure if you mentioned that in your videos, but if you're in Blight Town as a new player and you don't really know where to go up and down, every ladder always has torches on it. So if you see a torch, there's a pretty good chance that there is a ladder leading up or down at the torch. That's very good advice, Mr. Glyker. And very true. It's Something to always pay attention to, because it is very, very easy to get disoriented and lost in Blight Town. Yeah. But, but to be honest, follow my advice. Same. Follow my advice. Go in the back way. Don't do what I did. Take the easy way. <laughs> this is a, He gives that advice a lot, by the way. I once asked him oh, for, some, uh, uh, for some girl advice, and he was like, just go in the back way. It's the easy way. I'm like, all right. Well, it worked, didn't it? Well, it was interesting. I wouldn't say it was a shitty experience. Oh! Oh! <laughs> da, 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 da. Oh. You know what? I just See you later, fatties! Did you pick up the key to the new Londo room? I did, but that's only to show people where it is, because you don't actually... If you have the master key, you don't need that, of course. It's true. Also, I've actually got bored fighting the fatties, because it's, I'm going to be there all day. And the fatties are so fat. Yeah, I've run out of great combustion, so my likelihood of me getting killed is much higher. Anyway, we end up here, which is somewhere we want to come later, in fact. But for the time being, we're going across a bridge. The fatties can't follow us on. Because they're fat. Oh, that reminds me of going to show the Valley of the Drakes a little bit. Not at the moment, I'm not. I'll be coming back later. Okay. I'm just going to go showing the Firelink Shrine, then we're back, then I'm going to stop the recording, because i got bits I need to do off-camera. This is Basically, this is just like an extra video to show the um, ex escape from Blight Town. Ah, New London Ruins at 30 frames per second. My god. Anyway, uh, there is a dude down below who uh, is a blacksmith, but we don't actually need to see him currently, so we'll do that later. I'll be coming back here later, so don't really too fret too much about it. 
There's just stuff you really don't actually need to see at the moment. Do, 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 do. Ah, I love the like elevator. It. Please say the elevator. Ah, oh, balls. Oh, right, yeah, I can call it down, can't I? I forgot about that. And it'd be really crappy if there was a one-way elevator and if you didn't bring it down at the right time. <laughs> that would be horrible. That would be bad, even like for Dark Souls. That would be kind of mean, mm, wouldn't it? Delicious dung pies. Dung pies are awesome. They're pretty mean to throw at someone when you invade them. <laughs> oh god, yeah. He's like, well, what is it, dung pie to face? Well? What is it? I just well, what is it? The lift. The lift deserved it. All right. Ah, the safety of the filing shrine. Glad nothing could ever go wrong up here. <laughs> 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 Try jumping. Rating forty-two. Yeah. What? Really? What knobber stuck that up there? <laughs> yeah. Follow. Follow that advice. Yeah. Good, good plan. Rating forty-two is probably the best thing. Bit of a mean sense of humour. Well. Where's the firekeeper gone? Yeah. Oh, by the way, talking about ratings, there's actually a lot of people who have no idea that you can rate messages. Like, did you know that you can do it on two different ways? You can either use your orange soapstone to rate them by, you know, just using it on top of a message, or when you're reading a message, you just press select, because you better fucking be using a 360 controller, and then you can rate it immediately. And if you rate a message, the guy who wrote it gets one humanity. So, rate uh, as long as he's got three, it needs three or more um, rating well, to get one humanity. Yeah, but yes. True. Yeah. And yeah, Knight Lord Trek has killed the Firekeeper. <gasps> what a dick. Now we can no longer, uh, well, light the bonfire here, so we can't actually rest here anymore, which is a bit of a nuisance. Anyway, like I said, I've got stuff to do, uh, which you do not want to see because it's very, very, very boring and dull and lo involve lots of running around and backtracking. And the real set will come later tonight. Yes, so thank you very much. Bye bye.